Hi, this is Steve Spence with ArduinoTronics.blogspot.com and today we are working with load cells and we are making a digital scale. So what we have is a load cell that came out of a scale. We have an Arduino with a protoshield on top and an HX711 digital scale module. This is a 24-bit analog to digital converter with an amp onboard amplifier and it was designed specifically for reading digital scales. So on this proto shield, and you don't have to use a proto shield, but we wanted to make sure that all our connections were nice and tight. We put a four terminal strip to connect the scale to and we wired that to the A plus, A minus sensor um, wires and the B plus, B minus power from the scale to the board and on the other side of the board we have power, ground, clock and, dig and uh, data out. So We've connected clock and data out to A2 and A3, but we're not using them as analog pins. In the code, they are being changed to digital pins, which I don't know, a lot of people don't know that the analog ports on an Arduino can be repurposed as digital if you run out of digital. We weren't running out of digital, but the sample code that came for this sensor used those pins and we didn't feel like changing it. So we've got our wires connected, we've got our scale connected, we're plugged into the computer. The sketch is really simple. That is all there is to the sketch and I will be posting this on arduinotronics.blogspot.com because all the heavy lifting is done in the library, although there's not a whole lot of heavy lifting in the library as well. Here's our output. You can see that it's reading minus 0, 0.0 grams sometimes it'll read 0, 0.0 it means the same thing and we are going to take a 10 and a half gram screwdriver and put it on the scale and with any luck we'll show something around 10 and a half grams and what do you know there it is This sensor that we're using to connect to the scale is under $5 on Amazon with free shipping. Um, the load sensors, you can pull them out of any old digital scale that maybe the electronics has gone bad, but the load sensor is still fine. Or you can get them on Amazon for between 8 and 15 bucks. You can even buy a brand new scale for about $15 and just pull the load sensor out of it. It'll work with many different load sensors that have a variety of different maximum weights. Um, it does read in grams, you and code, you can do the conversion and change that to pounds or ounces or whatever you need. Um, as you can see, it's quite sensitive. I'm not sure what the resolution is, but it's in a percentage of a gram, um, at least less than a half a gram. Uh, sensitivity on this. So this is our scale project. Again, we'll post the schematics, we'll post the code, we'll post the library at arduinotronics.blogspot.com and thank you for watching our video.